as NCA, we believe that when an election has been contested, there will always be one winner. It doesn't mean, matter whether that winner is at a wide level as a councillor, or is a winner at a constituent level or as a member of parliament, or is a winner as a senator, or a winner as president. There will always be a winner. Because there would have been competition, there will always be losers. Some losers will be very good losers. Others will be very bad losers. But in every election, there are winners and losers. The NCA believes that for any country to progress, whoever wins an election must take office in terms of the Constitution. That is the person who would exercise the functions of a councillor or the functions of an MP or the functions of president. But they must, that's our belief as in a party, they must work with their losers. Between an election and the next election, governance must be an affair of those that have won, who are running affairs of state, and working alongside those that have lost election. And that belief is our belief. We believe that is the way to go. So there must be a pollard in every ward. So if you win and you are a councillor, in your ward, you are the councillor who is in office. You go to the district or uh, rural district council, by, or you go to the urban council. But within that ward, you must look out for those that lost elections competing with you. Try to work together. What do I do here? What are your views and so forth? If it is an MP, you have won as an MP, you go to parliament. You will be the one who will be in parliament. But when you get back to your constituency, look out for the losers, those you competed with. Find out how best to develop your, your constituency. And then if it is at a provincial level, we expect that those who are in the MPs in the province, they must look out for the politicians that lost as you go to the next. Similarly, at national level, if you become president, if I become president, I'll work with the losers. 